In this video, we're gonna be reviewing and unboxing the 18 inch newer ring light. You guys, I have it right here. You guys, this is number one on Amazon, so I already know I'm gonna like it. The reviews were great and that's why I bought it. So a couple of things about this ring light, it does come with its carrying bag, which is very nice. It also comes with the tripod. So it's the tripod, the actual stand for it. It's the actual ring light. And then we do have orange uh, lights or cases that you can put on the light. I'll show you guys what I'm talking about in a second. And it also comes with a remote. A lot of people are wondering if this is for cameras or if it's for phones and it's actually for both. So if you guys have a DSLR or if you guys are filming with your smartphone, this is gonna be it for you. So let's unbox it, check it out. I wanna kinda of like give it a little demo and see, um, so you guys could actually see how it looks too. So we don't have too many moving parts. We do have the carrying bag right here. You guys can see it's the newer and then it has the two boxes right here. I'm assuming this one is the actual stand, but we're gonna open it up and take a look. This is gonna be the ring light right here. You guys, I'm so happy to get this ring light because I wanna elevate my game. And right now I have two soft boxes. I actually only have one set up right now, but um, the, you guys, the ring lights are the way to go. It just looks so much nicer. It just, everything looks flawless with these lights. Okay, you guys, so this is it right here. This is what it looks like. Okay, that's the front side. This is the back side. Okay, we do have this is gonna be where the mount's gonna be at right here. We're gonna put the put that in there. And then this is a hot shoe mount. That's where we're gonna be either putting the camera or putting the phone. I'm gonna be using it for both. So that's cool that it has both. That's why I actually went with this one as well. And then this is gonna be the power connection right here. So let's unbox this first box here. Okay, so it is the stand. So we have the stand and then we also have the extender and this bends. Oh man, it's kind of hard to bend, but you could bend this right here. Uh, a lot of girls were uh, commenting and asking on uh, if you could use this for eyelashes and this does bend down. So you could use this for eyelashes. A lot of barbers use these. Every barber shop that I go to, they have a ring light because it's that nice full illumination. You can see what you're doing and you could, you know, fade up. Get it. I need to go to the barber shop right now, but you guys, it does. Uh, barbers do also use this. So let's check this out. Let's undo this. Okay, so here is the first part. It was kind of tough because it hasn't been done, you know, at all since it's brand new. But once you get it going, you can actually go up and down a lot easier. So you want to unscrew this and just fold that tripod out. Once it's folded out, you can actually tighten it up like this so it's not going to be going anywhere. Okay, so now it's time for this. And you guys, they're all, they're all going to be like that where you just unscrew and screw them. And then depends on the length that you guys are going for, okay? We're going to try to keep it short for this video so you guys can kind of see. Actually, let me extend it and then you guys see how long it is. And we'll go from there. You guys, I'm 5'9", so that's about the 5'9 mark, 5 feet 9 inches. And then we also have the extender. And then we have the ring light on top. <laughs> you guys, this could get pretty high up there. And then with the flexi tube, you could bend it down. And that's where people do the haircuts and all that good stuff. So it's up to you. But you guys, this is well over 6 feet right here, easily over 6 feet. So I just brought it all the way down to size right here. And I'd say that's probably, uh, I'd say like two feet or so all the way down like so. So that's on the smaller side right here. Let's open up the box and see what else, what other goodies we have. Okay. So we do have the orange covers. I'm gonna show you guys what that looks like. And then we do have the regular white clear ones that are right here, okay. Okay, so it also has, this is the clip for the phone for if you have an iPhone or Android, your phone slips right in there. And then we do have the screws under here. I'll show you guys what that looks like in a second. And then we do have the charger right here. So we got the actual box right here. And then this is what that looks like right here. This is a traditional computer power port connection right here. And all we're gonna have to do is connect this like so. And then this is a traditional US plug right here. 110 and then we're going to connect this to 
you guys seen it earlier so we're going to connect be connecting that to that once we're ready to turn everything on so we also have the manual that's right here just get all the goodies right there we do have the remote control which is pretty cool i wonder how that's gonna gonna work out in the future for me and then we also have this is where we're going to be connecting if we're going to be using our phones or if we're going to be using our camera okay so if we're using our camera actually you could use both of these for the camera and both of these for the phone so it kind of just depends on how mobile you want to be for this this is traditionally for a phone that way you could kind of move it around where this is nice and sturdy and it's for a camera so i'm going to show you guys how that works once i get this ring light on so now it's time to put our ring light on the stand and you guys can see we have two knobs here the top knob that's actually to have it twist up and down uh, actually let me show you guys just like that it goes up and down i'm going to lock it into place so it's not moving around on us and then the bottom knob you could actually unscrew it because we're going to be putting it on top of here once it's on there we could actually screw it all the way in so it's not moving around on us and i just noticed we're not level so let me level it up a little bit just like so now i want to show you guys the shoe mount that's right here so let's let's use our first little one right here all we have to do is unscrew it you guys can see that we could screw it or unscrew it all we have to do is slide this in here like so and then we can actually start screwing it in okay just like that so now you guys can see down here you get all you have to do is screw that in And then we just grab our phone, we lift it up just like that. And as you guys can see, it's coming straight forward. I have to, you know, adjust it and everything, but I just kind of want to show you guys how it looks when you have a phone on here and it's all the way at the bottom opposed to uh, somewhere in the center. Now let me grab my camera and show you guys how it looks with the camera on there. Okay, so now we want to put our camera in here. So what we're going to do is we're going to put that thread in there. Okay, that part's on there. So now we need to put this all the way down in here. Okay. And then this actually controls this, this knob right here to go up and down. So as long as we tighten this up, that's not going to be going anywhere and the camera will be secure. Okay. So now we have this nice and tight. It's good to go. Now we could actually turn the ring light on, see how it looks. And so this is, you guys, I told you two different ways. You could either have the camera or the phone on there. So we just plugged it in. Now it's time to actually connect it. And you just think it's like a regular connect, but you actually have to put it in and then give it a twist so it locks. That way it's not accidentally unhooking. You guys, this is the power source right here. So right now having it all the way clockwise is off. And then you guys just heard that little click right there that turns on and it is a dimmer so the more counterclockwise you go the brighter it's going to get so i want to show you guys how it looks with no covers on just the led lights and then we're going to go ahead and throw the the clear cover on and then we're going to throw the orange cover on just so you guys know it's the camera so it's going to be hard to kind of control the lights but i just kind of want to give you guys a feel for it so you guys could kind of see how it looks that's all the way bright right there. You guys can see. I hope you guys can see. So now let's do the clear one. So now it's time to put the covers on there. So they just kind of clip on. So just like so, and then we're gonna be putting all four of them on. Just like that, we have them all clipped on there. And now I can show you guys how it looks when we have the clear. All right, so now we're dimming it. So that's how it looks. Now we're gonna slap the orange one on there so you guys can kind of take a look at the orange one. So here goes the orange one. I just wanna let you guys know, I'm probably not gonna use the orange one. I'm probably gonna leave the clear one on there, but here we go, just so you guys can see it. Well, kind of glow, it gives it like that glowing feeling. That's all right, maybe I might use it, who knows? All right, you guys, I turned the lights off. I just wanted you guys to look at how it goes. So I'm gonna be turning it up just like so. Okay, so that's very dim. So, you know, you guys could be the judge of it. 
we're going brighter we're going brighter it's probably medium right there you guys can see how it looks if it looks good or not i do like how it lights everything up like so instead of like just the two shadow boxes over here so let's go that is very bright <laughs> and that's even brighter okay so if you think that looks good i mean this is the product for you i have to you know play around with it some more but so far so good i really do like it i didn't see any negative reviews maybe the only one i seen was where the phone and the actual camera get mounted maybe uh they said that that could be a little bit better but other than that you guys i do see this ring light i do like it i think the stand is sturdy i do like the lights the led lights i think it's nice and bright i definitely recommend this product